One of my favorite things about Omniverse is with Python and hot reloading, you can be coding and making changes and going back to Omniverse so quickly, it's really fun. But there's so many ways to interact with Omniverse and Python. Sometimes I wonder if everyone knows just how many ways there are. First of all, there's a script editor. This is like the one shot, type in some code, hit run, it runs. Behavior scripts give you a little more structure and you can attach it to objects in the scene. So a behavior script gives you a couple things. They give you callbacks for different events in the scene, but also you can type in self.prim and self.prim underscore path, and you get the prim that the script is attached to. It's a cool way to reuse little bits of code in different objects in your scene in a very quick kind of way. Leveling up a bit, you can write a whole extension. Extensions are sometimes referred to as the building blocks of Omniverse. You'll see a lot of the core functionality of Omniverse is actually delivered through extensions. You get callbacks for different events in the stage, and the easiest way to get started with an extension is to use the template generator. You can also make a connector. Like extensions, connectors are a form of plugin, but you can write your own for just about any application that needs to modify OpenUSD prims. Okay, and then probably the last, the highest level in some way, but you can make a kit application. So kit is an SDK a lot of Omniverse is built on, and you can make a whole standalone app. So extensions and all these other things run in an Omniverse app like Isaac Sim, but you can actually make your whole app, the whole thing, make everything. NVIDIA provides a repo that makes it incredibly easy to start up your own kit app using Omniverse apps like Composer or Explorer as a starting point. There are so many ways to interact with Omniverse with Python, and hopefully this quick overview gives you a sense of what tool might be best for your next project. Happy building.